Three years ago when we completed a $9 million renovation of our historic home at Clinton Woodbury, a five minute walk this morning, uh, plus 14 new artist apartments nearby, we began to look outside of our walls for opportunities to make an even deeper impact on our region. We are proud to play our part in the dynamic redevelopment of downtown Rochester during Mayor Warren's tenure. However, as wonderful as our two-stage performance facility is in the former New York State Arsenal building, there isn't available space for those within those formidable walls for doing the kind of year-round classes and community events that can now take place here on Site 7. Monroe and Howell will be a, will be a participation facility, not a performance venue. It will house three flexible studios as a center for learning, expression, conversation, and imagination. As far as we know, no other arts organization in our region has a standalone facility dedicated to these programs. We will conduct our own classes and connections, as well as partner with other nonprofits and community-based organizations for new collaborations. We want to take the next step in being a leader for service through the arts. I want to close by thanking Steve Dubnik and our good neighbors here at Strong Museum for their support of this project. We see our programming as a complement to their extraordinary mandate. I also want to thank our many donors who made the recent Jiva renovation possible and believe so deeply in Jiva's mission. And I want to thank our Board of Trustees who have overwhelmingly backed this new venture into serving our region. It is an exciting time to be part of Jiva Theatre Center and of Rochester. Together we are forging a 21st century city defined by its people, its passions, and its pride. Thank you very much.